the Hoover Dam, the Panama Canal, two of the world's greatest engineering marvels. And the UW-Madison grads who brought these projects to life were born and raised right here in Wisconsin. John Savage was probably the most eminent civil engineer of his time. In fact, many would say uh, maybe the most important civil engineer in the world at the time. He's best known for being the chief design engineer on three very large dam projects in the Western United States. The Grand Coulee Dam, the Shasta Dam, and the Hoover Dam. John Savage grew up in Cooksville, Wisconsin, and came here to University of Wisconsin to work on his degree in civil engineering. On the Hoover Dam, he was the chief design engineer. Success or failure really was on his shoulders. I think by growing up in Wisconsin, John Savage picked up that sort of Midwest humility. Um, and on a project like the Hoover Dam, uh, some humility is quite valuable. We find it in many of our alumni. They were small town, they might have been a farmer or something as a kid and ended up um, really affecting millions or tens of millions of people worldwide. I don't imagine he ever envisioned reaching the heights that he did. Many of his ideas are still used today. He definitely changed the world. Edward Schildhauer is the owner of the patents for the lock gates and the electric motors that pulled the ships through the Panama Canal. He was a local boy, born here in Holstein, grew up learning how to work hard, on his family's businesses. He applied, without going to high school, applied to the University of Wisconsin and was admitted to the mechanical engineering department in the electrical engineering area. Edward's education at the UW is extremely important. He wouldn't have had that opportunity to get that engineering background anywhere else. Panama Canal is the canal that links the Pacific and the Atlantic Ocean. The main problem was the locks and how to make those lock gates work because they were so heavy. If you look at his drawing books and the spec books that we have here, um, you can see that that mine had to be genius level to create these types of things that made all of this work. We would not have advanced as a world without that canal. Without Edward Childhauer, there would be no Panama Canal.